Hey there, curious how the WhatsApp business API actually works? Well, you're in the right place. Welcome to messagemind.ai, where we help businesses like yours connect with leads and customers more efficiently than ever. WhatsApp isn't just one app. There are actually three different versions. There's the regular WhatsApp for personal use, the WhatsApp business app for small businesses, and then there's the WhatsApp business API, the one we use at MessageMind. And today, we're going to break down exactly how it works, why it's different, and how your business can benefit from it. Let's start here. The WhatsApp business API is made for medium to large businesses who need to manage conversions at scale. But unlike the regular WhatsApp or even the business app, the API doesn't come with a mobile interface. You can't just download an app and start using it. It has to be connected to external messaging software, like MessageMind, where all your communication happens. This gives you the flexibility to use tools like automation, templates, and advanced reporting. It also means your team can collaborate inside a shared inbox powered by AI with no need to pass around one phone. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why not just use the WhatsApp business app? Well, the business app is great for small teams, but it has major limitations. There's no proper multi-user support, broadcasts are limited, and automation options are basic at best. It just doesn't scale. The API version, on the other hand, was built for high volume messaging. You can have unlimited team members manage thousands of chats, set up advanced workflows, integrate with your CRM or e-commerce store, and the list goes on. But, and this is important, using the API comes with some rules from Meta. First, businesses aren't allowed to just message anyone anytime. You can only start a conversation using pre-approved message templates. Meta does this to prevent spam, which keeps WhatsApp clean and trusted by its users. Second, there are fees for using the API, but only for sending templates. Regular messages you send during the 24-hour customer service window after a user initiates contact are completely free. Meta charges per conversation based on message type and the recipient's country. For example, sending a marketing template message in India might cost just over one cent, while the same message in the Netherlands could be 15 cents or more. There are also ways to reduce your costs. We'll explain that in our upcoming video on WhatsApp pricing, so make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. Now, let's talk about the 24-hour customer service window, because this is a key part of how WhatsApp messaging works. Whenever a customer messages your business, you have 24 hours to reply freely. You can send texts, images, videos, files, anything you need. This is called a session message. But once that 24 hour window passes, if the customer hasn't responded yet, you can't send another message unless you use a pre-approved template. These templates are reviewed by Meta to make sure they meet the guidelines. So basically, every time the customer replies, the 24 hour window resets and your conversation can continue without limits during that time. Another thing to keep in mind is that each WhatsApp number can only be tied to one version of WhatsApp. So if you're using a number on the business app, you'll need to unregister it before moving to the API. And one more behind the scenes detail, every WhatsApp business number is assigned a quality rating. If too many users block your number or mark messages as spam, your quality score goes down. That can limit how many messages you're allowed to send each day. So it's really important to keep your messages relevant and welcome. So how do you get started with the WhatsApp API? The fastest way is by going through a WhatsApp business solution provider like messagemind.ai. At messagemind, we help you get approved, set up your WhatsApp business account and connect your number to a powerful messaging inbox. You'll be able to run smart automations, upload contact lists, automatically sync outbound contacts from your CRM or meta lead forms, manage inbound customer conversions efficiently with your team and track performance in real time. It's the simplest way to manage and scale your customer conversations. So if you're ready to take your WhatsApp strategy to the next level, go ahead and click the link in the description to learn more about MessageMind. And if you found this helpful, don't forget to give us a like, subscribe, and stay tuned for our next video where we break down WhatsApp pricing in 2025. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep the conversation going at messagemind.ai.